That's cool. What's chapter three looking like? The Celestial Resort. Be proud of your death count. The more you die, the more you're learning. Keep going. Okay. That black stuff doesn't look like it's probably healthy, is it? Oh, I turned the look away because I heard my dog. Alright, there we go. right into that oh key Please ring for service. Hello? What's up, ghost buddy? Welcome. May I help you? Are you a ghost? A ghost? Don't be silly. I'm the concierge of this fine establishment. Welcome to the world-renowned Celestial Resort Hotel. Miss Earl Cheryl, at your service. Two guests in one day, business is finally picking up. How long will you be staying with us? Oh, I'm just passing through. I'm climbing the mountain. Do you have a back exit? A back exit? Just passing through, this will not do. You know, I can still hear you, right? In any case, our rare service door is reserved for hotel staff only. However, our top floor presidential seat features a world-class view with a peak. Yes, you'll be quite comfortable up there. Maybe I could get on the roof and climb back down. Presidential suite. Marvelous idea, Cheryl. What is your name for our records? I'm Madeline. But again, I'm really not interested in saying. Right this way, Miss Madeline. It appears to be a very old and dusty guest book. Many of the pages are damaged or missing. The comments, however, are glowing. We'll never forget our time here. I've never felt more at peace. Thank you. Okay. Oh. Whoop. We just we just take our time. the first time I don't remember that being there the first time oh I need a key up oh, there's the key Ooh, there was a secret there where's this going? how do I get up there 
Oh, that's how you get up there, I see. But, oh. Okay, 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 okay. So now I want to drop that so it's broken. I got that strawberry, let's go on back. Let's go. Whoops, is that safe to touch? gonna build Follow me closely, Miss Madeline. The elevator is just down the hall. This hotel is a uh, pretty rough shape. Is it really open for business? Of course we're open. The Celestial Resort Hotel would never close during prime tourism season. Rough shape. What does she mean by that? Oh, please allow me to carry your luggage. My bag? No thanks. I'll keep it. Hmm, very well. What a peculiar guest. Strawberries. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, I just wanted to. Struggles with grab and jump sometimes. Alright, 
Whoa. Nice. I'm not really sure what I did, but it worked. Grab. There we go. Boom. Okay. My brain is struggling with the keys. Oh, what's going on in here? Miss Madeline, I really need to, <coughs> excuse me, implore you to keep up. I'm running a world-class establishment here. I don't have time to wait around for meandering guests. You really don't have to wait for me. I'm just looking for a way through this place. Oh, Cheryl, you idiot. The customer is always right. Business is finally pick it up and you lose your temper. Oh, of course, Miss Madeline. My sincere apologize. I was out of line. Please, feel free to explore at your leisure. Is out of control. When did this happen? I don't really know where to begin. Miss Cheryl, Cheryl, did you run this whole place by yourself? You're right, Miss Madeline. I never sort this mess out alone. It's hopeless. That's not what I meant. Just breathe, Miss Cheryl, Cheryl. Breathe. It's just a little spring cleaning. Well, more than a little. But I can help. You're too kind. But I wouldn't any bother. It's a lost cause. Alright, let's help him out. He's freaking out. back up. 
Aw. Hey, what up, bro? I'm helping. I haven't begun cleaning and already I feel renewed lightless spirit. That's the power of positive thinking. Um, actually, I cleared out some of the clutter for you. Oh, yes. Thank you, Miss Madeline. But please, relax and let the hotel staff have it. Well, sure, you fool. You're losing her. Guess I want to spend her time cleaning. Are you okay? Yes, of course. This is the finest hotel you'll ever visit. You'll see. How could I let my problems pile up like this? Oh. What happens if what's what's this way? Okay. All right, let's clean out some more of the mess. Oh, Theo. Theo, are you a guest here too? Madeline, I'm so happy to see you right now. I'm all about spoken mysteries, but this is getting too real. Have you talked to Mr. Oshiro? I think he can really use some help. You think? He's a creepy old weirdo. I bet he's cleaning out a nook to hide her bodies as we speak. I'm gonna crawl through this vent and blow cold air in from the outside. Come on! Mr. O'Sheryl's trouble, but I don't think he wants to hurt us. He just need to clean up this mess. I want to help him. Madeline, that's very sweet, but this is dangerous. We need to get out of here and call an expert on creepy old dudes. We are prepared for this. I think I could get through to him. Go on ahead, I'll catch up with you later. Man, you're more than stubborn than my sister. I thought that was impossible. Take care of yourself. Thanks, Theo. I'll see you outside. Ah. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, what was the point? Oh, I'm blind, man. I'm blind. Wait, how would I even get to that? I don't know. Oh, unfortunate, they say. Six out from the mid clutter. Attention hotel staff. 
It is my sad duty to inform you that the Celestial Resort Hotel will close indefinitely following this season due to circumstances beyond our control. It was an honor to have served alongside you all as we worked tirelessly to ensure that our guests enjoyed the most hospitable and memorable experience as possible. Write this with a heavy heart. This hotel has become my home, its staff and patrons, my family. I will miss you, Derry. Mayor Cheryl Cheryl. What's this? Ooh. We're booting up Celeste on a PC. Nice, we're playing Celeste again. We're playing Celeste and Celeste. We got stuff to do. Now playable for the menu. I don't know how long that goes, but that could have gone on forever. We got the main game to play. Where's Mr. O'Shuro? Let's see, I don't remember some of my keybinds now. It's looking a lot nicer in here. Can you show me the exit now? But Ms. Madeline, you barely enjoy the myriad luxuries that our hotel has to offer. We could talk more once I'm finished clearing. I'm very busy. Yes, some people have no respect these days. You're welcome. Sheesh. All right, the last spot. Do 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 do. Okay, where's Mr. O'Shara though? Is he in here? Mr. O'Shara, there you are. Alright. There you are. You certainly have a knack for wandering off. It was tough, but I sorted everything out for you. The Solicitor Resort Hotel extends its gratitude for your assistance, Miss Madeline. Of course, the staff has had the mess under control. Oh, sure. Yeah. How humiliating. You must be eager to see your room. It's just at the top elevator. Uh, it's just up the elevator and down the hall. Sure. What the heck? Show me the presidential suite. It sounds lovely. Now's your last shadow, Cheryl. Don't lose her now. Oh. oh wait, the elevator doesn't work? I gotta... My brain with the controls for jump and climb. I... This is gonna be hard.
Alright, I just got through. Hello, Theo? Man, it's amazing here. How's it going with El Creepo? I helped him clean up that huge mess, but he's kind of a jerk about it. And he still thinks he can convince me to stay. Madeline, seriously. My bad idea radar is off the charts on this one. You should get out of here. If I disappear now, we're so sure I can have a meltdown. Maybe I can actually do something good. For once. Forget your karma, dude. I think that guy is gonna melt down no matter what. You have to think about your safety. Theo, I'll be okay. Yeah, yeah, I didn't expect you to listen. See you on the outside, jailbird. Oops. for me. This is it, Cheryl. Your last chance. You already ruined it. Making a close clean up your mess. She'll never stay. No, she's still here. There's still a chance. Your presidential suite, it's a key. It will surely impress her. Uh oh. Get it together, O'Cheryl! Oh no, O'Cheryl! There you are, Miss Madeline. Miss Madeline? Follow me quickly, we're almost there. I, you, you put a lot of negative thoughts in the way, I can't just follow you. doing there's dash oh, okay. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out about a controller one day. Keyboard controls just don't work with brain. Alright, we need a key. Side on lot. I found a cassette tape. Oh, they just put me at the beginning. That's nice. It's Mitchell Cheryl's diary. The final entry appears to be decades old. As of today, the hotel is officially closed. Charlotte organized the staff for a farewell hike up the mountain. Most of us have never seen the summit. It seemed like a fitting goodbye, but when the time came, I couldn't bear leave without a looking around one last time. I told him to go without me. I will catch up with them soon after I double checked that everything is in order. Can't believe my time here is over. What am I going to do now? Perhaps I'll save one last night so that the hotel and I can have a proper goodbye. He doesn't kill himself, does he? That's not what this, this is hinting at, is it? Let's go. Here we are, our award-winning presidential suite. Truly, it is the very definition of rustic luxury. I'll stand back and allow you to soak in the majesty. I understand it can be a lot to handle. So, what do you think? It's, uh, it's beautiful. The furniture looks expensive. It's very spacious. The colors are elegant. I could tell you put a lot of work into it. I knew you would be impressed, you. Yeah. So, can I get on the roof from here? You imbecile, you're losing her. Oh, er, I almost forgot to mention. You value guests such as yourself saying their finest accommodations at half price. I don't want to say. Please, Miss Madeline, please stay. Mr. Oshero, I have already been sidetracked too long. Uh-oh. 
is evil Madeline or pragmatic Madeline Madeline sweetie forget this loser loser you're in denial old man this resort is a dump no one would ever want to stay here someone had to say it she doesn't mean that I I'm very busy please leave Miss Madeline Come on, Miss Madeline, you heard a man. Whoa. Where would you be without me? Probably happy. Why would you say my beautiful hotel is a dump? I'm sorry, bro. I thought we would never get rid of him. You owe me one. Add it to the list. Leave me alone. I thought you were so determined to keep climbing. Now all of a sudden, you're some weirdo therapist? Why won't you go away? Miss Madeline, before you go, I need to ask one question. Why would you be so nice to me, only to run away? What did I do wrong? Oh, give it a break. You still don't get it. She only helped people to feed her twisted ego. She never cared about you. Shut up. I just wanted to help. You're both pathetic. Oh, uh, pathetic? You only came here to humiliate me? I won't grovel at your feet any longer. Oh. Oh. Ooh, that was sweet. Ah, oh, that's gonna be tricky. I have paid you, guys. Yeah. Try to jump on top of that. See the colors. That's what I'm gonna blame it on. Woo! Mr. Cheryl, stop! 
I just wanted to help. Dang pragmatic me. I've decided to close the hotel for repairs. The second floor plumbing is uh, leaking. The library is in complete disarray. Not to mention the hole in the ceiling in a presidential suite. Please just leave me alone. Chapter 3 complete. Let's go. Yikes. B side a lot. So I guess every level has a B side. Uh, yeah, every, every level has to be 44 minutes for that level. but I'm gonna go ahead and call it there for the streaming and this recording and everything